We're having a lot of fun doing this. We're, we've encountered some challenges, but you know, that's kind of how life goes. You know, there's challenges happening all around us. Um, it can be a little overwhelming. Um, sometimes you're not really sure like where to plug in or how to help out. And uh, you know, the village is a really interesting new community that's being built online. And rather than see our digital you know, technologies as being problems, what we're trying to do is, is see how they can be used for good. Um, and so the village is, is meeting virtually, we're meeting online, but we're, we're really doing it human to human and, and we're really making connections that, that matter and mean, mean something to people and really help out. So the village is kind of like a support group, but it's also like a civic group because we're getting involved with some of the nonprofits that we've mentioned tonight and uh, we're getting involved in each other's lives a little bit. So if you're looking for, you know, some connections, if you're looking to meet some people that are uh, not in the groups that you're in now, you join a diverse community and uh, hear some different perspectives, uh, we encourage you to come check out the village. Uh, for more information about the village, you'll need to talk to someone in the village uh, so they can invite you. So if you know me, come reach out to me. If you know Andre, talk to him. Uh, anybody who's in the village can invite you in and, and be a part of one of those. And, and we have villages that are in Seattle and in Boise, Idaho as well. Like to meet, to have like a group of people through a medium that I'm quite skeptical of in terms of being able to make the kind of connections that I like. It, that's been like freaking awesome. It was so like, almost seamless in connecting with you people. So thank you. I think for me, the village has provided an opportunity to make friends during a time where that feels impossible and, they're in, and that we're stuck at home. So the fact that I've never met most of you in person, but still um, have this anchor to my week where I can see friendly faces and talk about things that I don't get to talk about in any of the other groups that I manage or organize or participate in is, um, feels like, you know, something that's become really important during this super weird time in our lives. This, I would say the village has been intentional community that's really gotten me through the past eight months. So, um, yeah, I'm just really grateful for all of you and that you keep showing up and that I get to be a part of this. The, this has been just an amazing space. Um, I, I feel like I can just come in to the village, have my grounding, have my, it, it's like a, it's like a room, like a safe place, you know, with familiar faces where I can feel heard. I feel of value. I feel like I get to practice active listening and just important communication skills and just hear amazing perspectives from people from so many different walks of life. And that's immensely powerful and it comes every week and I look forward to it every week and I make time for it every week because it's become so important. I've been thinking a lot of this word sanctuary and it's a powerful word. I think of sacredness, I think of, you know, like an actual space, I think of a place of refuge, an oasis after a long journey, and and this place has a little bit of that feel, it's a sanctuary. When, when I think of a, a, of, of a space that I can come into and I can be whatever level of messiness I am that day and still be seen and, and, and held, that's a special place. Um. You know, with the village, I've you know just been able to you know be part of the gatherings, help out with some of the back end stuff, make the videos, just you know have those conversations. Even me, just a lot of meeting, a lot of things to do, and that's been um, meaningful. And I guess just to just to kind of also watch everyone be in this space <laughs> every single week is just uh, you know really cool. And the point is just all the small takeaways, all the small views, all the small differences build will be created together. I would think that it's been a good learning experience for me being able to connect and just listen to different perspectives with people that I would normally under normal circumstances probably not have those kinds of interactions with some of you enjoy just coming to hear what is important to everyone and what everybody is talking about and what is everybody is thinking about. That's a learning 
process for me that I value in this in this group. Very, very relaxed. I feel safe. I feel accepted. Um, as I think I might have mentioned to some some of you that for 20 years I've been in school every quarter on campus. It was five, you know, five days a week. And the last six months, you know, it's been different, a different world. And, and having this village is like a family in a way. You know, we have that comradeship with people you trust. Uh, who feel the same in a lot of ways. Different stories, but, but deep down, we share a lot. I know why I keep coming back, honestly. Uh, <laughs> it's not that I don't want to, I just don't know why I do. Um, maybe I feel like it's a duty or an obligation. Uh, Thanks for everyone for sharing. That was really that was really nice, and it's been nice to get to know all of you. And I think a lot of what we're creating is not magical at all. It's just human relationships, which are very important in life. According to science, you can have two to three hundred relationships like this. You can manage two to three hundred relationships in your life. So we've kind of gotten into a place as a society where we don't have that many. So it's kind of nice to think about expanding your bubble and feeling some power from the connections that you have, because ultimately the more connections you have, the more you can do uh, in life. But I do just want to take one second, if you had one more, just to take a breath before we leave today. So if everyone doesn't mind, just a big deep breath in through the nose. And let that go. Thank you guys. Thanks, Andre. Take care, everyone. We'll see you next week. Okay, are we ready? Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. All right, awesome. Three. <laughs> All right.